Today I'm going to do a review on South Ward's uh, new jackknife lockpick set. Comes in this nice attractive box. It has an instruction card. For those of you who've never used jackknife set, how to use the tensioner, how to uh, tension the lockpicks in the handle. Very convenient, very nice. You get a uh, wired keychain that attaches, sticking it in the hole here and pulling it. It doesn't screw, it attaches like an old uh, keychain does. And you get the check knife. And what's new about this is that originally the first one was made out of aluminum. And over the years they tried different materials. One year they had a composite handle. And then they went to an alloy. And now they've gone back to aluminum. Except with this one, they coated it with a black anodized material. Same kind of material they use for... Uh, and gun parts. It's a matte finish. Very attractive. Works identically the way it did orig originally. And I'll go over that. But I have to say this is exceptionally well made. There's no sharp edges. They're all rounded, smooth. Feels good in your hand. And what you do, the first thing you do is to remove the tensioner. You do that by depressing on this bent part with your thumb and push the uh, tensioner forward like that. And it pops out the handle. And this is made out of stainless steel, 0.02 uh, thickness, inch thickness. And to remove the uh, picks, you undo this narrow knob, which has a rubber grommet there. Turn it, and the picks come out like that. And the model number of this is a JP6 because it has six picks in it. It retails. Uh, as of December 2021 for $39.95 plus shipping. I got that one. So that makes six. Has a uh, shallow hook, a city rake, half ball, a diamond, a snake rake, and a short hook. And these are made out of stainless steel, 0.02 inch thickness as well. And there are no sharp edges on this. These are tumbled very well, very smooth, exceptionally well manufactured. Now we'll try and pick a lock with one of these. You pull out, of course, the pick you want to use, pull it all the way forward, it'll stop. And put the other picks down in there. Then you take the narrow knob, you tighten it as tight as you can. It does wobble slightly. So what I do is, I have a pair of pliers here I tighten it down with to keep it from moving. And we'll try out this Master 140. We're using the uh, short hook. Really 
This lock has one spool in it. There we go. And now we'll try another pick and another lock. Uh, let's try the snake rake. We can rake a lock. And we'll try this master number 40. This clock. together. Just close it up and I'll show you how to put these back in here in just a minute. But uh, one thing I, if I could change this, one thing I would change is the, uh, the width of the picks. They're very wide so you need a with a large keyhole. This is another southward pick. Short hook. It's a euro. Look how thin that uh, shank is compared to the jackknife. So they were all like this. I think this would have a lot more use. But that's minor. Now to put this back in, what you do is you take the end, stick it down inside here, as far as it goes. And you work the L in down there. And then you have jackknife all closed and ready to go. The tensioner doesn't fall out, it's in there pretty well. So overall, for $39.95, I believe this is a good value. Now there are these other Jack knife sets, the uh, Covert Companion, and the Swick, but you really can't compare them to this. These uh, have many more picks to them, and they run, you know, up to $100 or more, depending upon how many picks you get and how many accessories you get. This one's around uh, $80, I believe. These are excellent also, but so is this. So if you can't afford these, this is your next spec, best bet. And I think it's a, a very good basic set. It has all the type of picks, shapes that you want to have, the hooks, the rakes. So. I hope this will help you uh, decide whether or not you want to get a jackknife and what kind you want to get. So have a good evening. And this will be my last video until probably after Christmas. And I plan on having a uh, real big giveaway. So I hope you'll uh, watch out for that coming probably late December, early January. It's uh, giveaway I don't think has been done before, and I hope you'll get involved. Thanks again.